In this scenario, Chewy wants to attach a file uh, to an email that he's sending to his counselor, Ms. Gomez. Where should he click to attach a file that is saved in his Google Drive? So in scenario 4A, which we uh, demonstrated how to attach a file saved on your computer's hard drive, now we're going to attach a file saved on your Google Drive. So I'm going to start my message here, send it to Ms. Gomez, give it a subject, file you requested, send a short message here. Here is the file you wanted. Let me know if you have any questions. So now when we, uh, in 4A, we use the uh, paperclip button here to attach a file from our computer's hard drive. And now we're gonna go over to the Google Drive button right here. It looks like a little triangle. It's also the same. You can, if you uh, look closely, you can tell that it's the uh, same logo as Google Drive. So I'm gonna click there. It's going to open up my Google Drive and it will pop up. No matter what computer you have, it's going to look the same uh, when you uh, attach a file from Drive. Now, the other way, using the paperclip, it's going to look different depending on which computer you're on. But no matter what computer you're using, it will look the same when you choose the Google Drive option. So I'm going to choose one of the files here, click Insert, and once you see it pop up here, it's ready to roll, and then I click Send. And in this case here, when you uh, attach something for Google Drive, you have to give them permission to view the file on your drive. And right here, I can choose either to give them viewing permission, comment, or editing. It's completely, totally up to you. For the, for the sake of this demo, I'm going to change it to edit permissions. And then I click send. And then the uh, email is sent with that document attached.